Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from Spirit for all of us who are all on this journey to love. And today is Valentine's Day. It's a day to celebrate love. So happy Valentine's Day to everyone out there. And I hope that everyone is doing okay. I know that today can be <laughs> very... Um, very triggering <laughs> so uh uh but i think the older i get the less it is so that's good that's good that's one thing that comes with uh getting more wisdom let's say <laughs> rather than saying getting a bit older getting more wisdom so um I'm going to get start with Messages of Love Oracle, amazing deck. I'm also going to read today from this beautiful poetry book, which I've said about her before. She is, um, this book is called Fragmented Togetherness. Um, this lady, she has another book as well, but it's a book of poetry. Beautiful. I love the artwork. Amazing. And... Um, just gorgeous, actually. Just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And uh, so I'm going to pick a, um, open the book at whichever poem that we need to know about. And also then, uh, for, as it's a love day today, as it's a special day, I am going to take some number requests. So if you would like to have a, a number read out, um, choose a number between 1 and 266. So choose a number between 1 and 266, put that number into the comments field, and I will then do a video where I read out the number of the relevant letters. And there will be a message for you from your divine counterpart, from your twin spirit within the letter, um, because they are always just ridiculously um, in sync, right? <laughs> So let's have a look because it is a celebration of love and love lets you, you know, love is a very, very powerful emotion. You can't help it. You can't stop it. You can't. It just is. Right. And that there is no real it's it's there is no real explanation. It's just this amazing, powerful energy. And uh, we're, that's what we're here to celebrate each and every day. But, you know, let's just say so today is the whole planet is, is like heightened because it is one of those commercial days that everyone else gets involved. But we celebrate it every single day. So, look, the timing isn't quite right. Huh? I mean, seriously, today of all days, we're getting the timing isn't right. You know, divine timing. So it's all right. Don't worry. If you are like me, then you will have been waiting a very long time to have a Valentine's Day with the actual person that you love and to receive <laughs> all the love in the physical um, so it always, it, it happens in the spiritual all the time. It would be nice if we can get it in the physical. So, because this is a divine partnership, it's fated. It's okay that we have to wait a bit longer. <laughs> you know, spirit knows best. Spirit knows best. Who are we? Who are we to, um, to say... <laughs> go slow <laughs> who are we to say come on speed it up i want one more because i'm like i don't want go slow i don't want wait i want something else look it's already here and now it's already the connection that you seek is already in your life this is a past life connection it's okay that we're going on the slow-mo train it's okay to wait a bit longer because this is a destined partnership because it is a past life connection which is super super strong <sighs> there we go so um you know that's the thing we don't know when the time is right we have to trust so i'm going to go with the um the fragmented togetherness um and let's have a look this is the poem, it's to healing. 
Ah, this is by her brother. So it says, the climb up the mountain may seem long at first. You're full of motivation. You have to quench your thirst. You keep your eyes at the top, the glistening peak, but it seems so far away, you can hardly speak. The walk is hard, long and slow, but now you're on the path, you already know. You stop looking at the peak and set eyes on the ground, for it is the journey where the kings are crowned. The storm subsides and the path becomes clear. For if you just look ahead, the end is always near. You start to realise now that there is no end. The growth comes in the journey. Enjoy it, my friend. So, and the little uh, letter is, when life feels like it's falling apart, have faith in coming back together stronger, braver, and more you than ever before. Trust in your fragmented sense of self. Dance in the in-between. Smile through the uncertainty. Life has a way of surprising us with its timely genius, its perfect messiness. Embrace the process of transformation, surrender, the old, and allow yourself to be reborn. It may feel slow and painful. You may be faced with your own resistance, but persevere, divine warrior, because you're in for a hero heroic journey ahead. Oh, so each of the poems are just so gorgeous. And how lovely it was that was that particular one that I picked was actually by her brother. Um, so Tanya has a, um, uh, you can order her books, but her Instagram is at T underscore flourishing goddess. I don't know if you can see that at T underscore flourishing goddess. Um, or fullriseflourish.com T underscore flourishing goddess so go check it go get this book just absolutely gorgeous poetry um, okay so now I'm going to do a magic one this is from my book <laughs> so let's fit so I am grateful for seeing the magic in life everywhere around me I am grateful for seeing the magic in life everywhere around me. I'm grateful for seeing the magic in life everywhere around me. And I'm also going to check, read the other mantra, which is, I open my heart wide to the magical flow of love and abundance. So always open our hearts wide to the magical flow of love and abundance. May it shower down on all of us <laughs> in abundance. Um, let us, there's lots of birds in the trees in front of me and, um, they are bl the black crows, which is the, the sign of change. And, uh, we are, as we're all changing all the time. So, um, I am going to, uh, read a letter from Divine Love Letter Books. So as I said before, if you would like to have a letter read out today because it is a special day to celebrate love, um, if you add a number between one and 266 in the comments field below the video, um, I will then read that corresponding letter out. So if there's a few of them, I'll just do um, add multiple ones to a video and put videos out during the day, or this it'll probably be this evening. But so here we go. Uh, so what is the number? I'm hearing 118, 118. <laughs> so 118 it is. So here we go. It is that you are the love of my life. The only one that I can see myself growing old with. The only woman that I have truly loved. That everything up until, was, until you was just a game. And I haven't really felt for anyone even an ounce of how I feel about you. It totally blows every other relationship or anything out of the water. You are the face I wake up with every day, the voice I hear inside my head as I go to sleep. The beat of my heart every day beats to be back in rhythm with you again, two hearts beating as one in perfect harmony. That is what I dream of, lying in your arms, head on your heart, listening to your heartbeat in time with mine. I cannot wait for the day that we can come together as one. Living the dream, fulfilling all of our fantasies together, the ultimate play partner, the ultimate lover, the ultimate friend. You are beyond any doubt going to be mine till the end of time. I'm going to make it happen. Oh, yes, please. Okay, 
yes please and I'm like yes please yes please 118 book two that are completely and utterly 100 percent and head over heels and beyond the milky way into the stratosphere and back in love with you i want to be back with you to be everywhere that you are to share in every part of your life to make our life together to be coexisting co-creating co-blissing to be in a state of pure and adulterated love no shame no doubt no fear no holding back, nothing but us. Nothing but us creating a wonderful life of adventure, of happiness, of exploration, exploring our bodies, exploring our souls, exploring our hearts, exploring everything together. I really want that now, believe. Okay, so that is book <laughs> two, and then we have book three, so. I think we all want that. So you are my rainbow. You're my pot of gold. I want to cover you with gold paint and let us both shimmer and shine in our brilliance, in our soul's essence. I want our soul's love for each other to shine its brilliant gold glitter on the world. Your heart is gold. Your heart makes me want to shout out from the root. I mean, sorry, I've just seen the sentence, the next sentence, and it's about the mountain and the poem from Tanya's brother was about the mountain. <laughs> so again, how the letter connects with, I mean, just, okay, so your heart is gold. Your heart makes me want to shout out from the rooftops about how love can really change the world. How love can move any mountain. How love can change your life. I am so in awe of you, in awe of our connection, in love with being in love with you. Well, I am in awe of the connection of how all of the messages interconnect, how those sort of synchronicities happen, how seeing things, how how it all works. I mean, I am completely in awe of it all um, because that was, you know, the, her Tanya's brother's letter is just so beautiful about you know, it's not about getting to the top of the mountain. It's about enjoying the process as you're getting there. And it could be slow and it can be really, really hard. But that there isn't an end. It's just the growth comes in that journey. And we're all doing that journey together. And we're all growing together. And um, that's, that's, that's the beauty of it, right? That is the beauty of it. So... Ugh. Just amazing. So there we go. Um, what a gorgeous message to get on this celebration of love. So I am going to do one more. <laughs> one more. I'm just going to shuffle, 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 shuffle. I just say, okay, what is the last message that the twin spirit would like to give us? What is the last message that the twin spirit would like to give us? <laughs> Guess what it is? <laughs> And this is a bit tongue-in-cheek. It's saying, don't miss the red flags. And I'll tell you why, because my my um, intu intuition instantly is saying, the red flags being red is the heart, of this, red is the colour of love, isn't it? And um, that don't miss something that will happen to you today um, that will represent something from your twin spirit. It will be red. It will be something. <laughs> And so that's why it's saying don't miss those red flags. I actually had yesterday, I was walking down the path and um, completely, again, just on the pavement was a red rose head just lying there on the pavement. Just one, just one red rose, <laughs> not the stem, just the head, just there, right in my door, right in my footsteps. So um, don't miss the red flag and the red flag could be anything, but I'm sure there'll be something that crosses your path today that is your twin spirit saying, yes, 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 I am here. So I really hope that helps. And remember, if you do want to have a shout out, a letter read out, pick a number between one and 266, add it to the comments and I will do a collective video where I read the letter requests out. All right, that's it. Happy Love Day, everyone. Hope you all have a good day. 
I'll be back later with another video. Um, and again, I'm doing letters and uh, channelings today. So you'll get it by the end of your day. Um, so don't worry, you will receive it today. All right, take care. Bye.